Hello everyone, it's TC Tykeela here, part 2 of 4 for the DLC, and I did not record my live commentary for this one, I I did it, I was talking the whole time, but I reached to get my iPod at the end to end the recording, and I did not restart the court or start the recording, not restart, so this one isn't live, but I will walk you through um, the downhill map and through this game, my first game on downhill. It won't be my very first impressions, obviously, because I said them in the game, and I'm not going to say verbatim what I said, because I forgot, obviously, or it would be recorded. Um, this one is about... It's a, down, it's a snowy map, and right now this room that we're in is probably going to be a high traffic area. Um, the gondolas, the dying, the moving parts is probably going to attract everyone, at least for the first couple days while everyone checks it out. Expect to see some deaths by gondola, um, in your kill feed. Um, so I was going to wake up at about 3 or 4 or even 3.30 to download the DLC this morning. My alarm went off. My girlfriend says that. At least I didn't hear it. I woke up at my 6 o'clock alarm. So I got to download it. And um, it took a while though. I started at about 6.05. It's 1.7 gigabytes I think. And I think the Black Ops 1 DLCs were about 700 megabytes. Oh, <laughs> dodging. Dodging uh, gondolas right there. That's that's a game in itself. You got an additional game in this DLC. Anyway, like I was saying, um, so it's a substantially bigger. If my uh, remember my <laughs> remembrance, uh, my my thoughts about my memories of the file size of each games map packs are correct it's uh, quite a lot bigger usually it took me about 30 or 45 minutes to download a dlc in black ops 1 maybe even a little shorter but this one took me a whopping hour and a half hour 45 minutes i will i like i said i started at about 605 and i did not finish till 750 and so by that time i had to jump in the shower and get ready to head on my way to school so I wasn't able to do any games. I did set up a class or two, and I do have the peacemaker, Peacekeeper on one of my classes, but I'm not using that. I will talk to you about that one in the next video. Um, that one is on Mirage. I already recorded all of them. All the other three videos are live commentaries, but as I said, I didn't get this one. I had some technical difficulties, and this one is part two. Um, so far, I like this map. Um, I chose not to use a assault rifle because... Oh, oh, give me that spawn. Jeez. That was nice. If that would have been hardcore, all three of them would have been dead. I would have been still tearing it up in their spawn. Um, I'm going to talk about the Peacekeeper. I think that's what I was saying. I can't remember now. I'm concentrating too much on the game. Oh, I was talking about the map. I'm um, not using an assault rifle because there, there, there are a couple of long lines of sights, as in most maps, but for the most part, there's rocks blocking those sights, or this fun bag. Fun bag, I, I remember saying something about the fun bag when I shot at it. So, everyone loves fun bags. <laughs> Am I right? Um, so, for the most part, it's pretty close combat, um, and as my style, I'll try to stay out of the long sights anyway, so there's no real need for it, and I'm not going to be camping up too much. Ooh, almost died. Oh, nice nade from me lobbing it over those rocks. And especially that building over there with the gondolas, tight quarters, need um, a, a high firing, high rate of fire gun. And I was looking at those right there. 
I was gonna see if they hit you when they come around. I thought it came around the pole and went back into the gondola station, but it doesn't. It doesn't hit you. And I was gonna see. I ran forward, see if I can jump up and get it to hit me. But that's when I figured out it went straight up, so I didn't bother to stay there any longer and decide. You guys can see that for yourselves and let me know how that goes for you. Test out how you can. All the ways you can die by gondola. Um, I didn't die in this one from it, so, so far, so good. And we are getting whooped right now, 37.66, nearing the end of the game. Um, I'll get a nice nade right here as he EMPs me. And I'll look at my KD at the end of the game. I think I'm pretty close to even. Uh, actually, I think I am even, if my memory serves me right. But overall, I like this map so far. Um, out of the two you've seen, Downhill and uh, Grind, I think this one I like better. But we'll have to see how it plays out. Look at all them hit markers. Can't get it. I'm trying to go around. But I, oh, look at that white screen. White screen, he gets me. And we get whooped, as I said. And that will do it. 10 and 10 for an even KD of 1, and I get a cameo in the final kill cam. So yeah, parts 3 and 4 coming up soon with Mirage and Hydra respectively.